In this packet tracer example, we'll configure ERGRP for IPv6. We'll use the topology and IPv6 addresses on the screen. Firstly, we'll configure the interface IPv6 IP addresses for all the routers. Let's start. So I check something here.
as you can see our all interfaces are up now it is time to configure EIGRP on interfaces and globally on uh, the routers uh, let's start with router 0 Firstly, uh, we create the uh, EIGRP session and then uh, we give uh, uh, a route writing here. And now uh, we will uh, enable the EIGRP on, on the interfaces uh, for VESA uh, Tenant 00 and VESA Tenant 01. Yes. And for the other interface. We will do uh, the same uh, configuration on router 1 and router 0 and for router 1. Also, see in our configuration here. As you can see, our uh, EIGR for IP version 6 uh, here, but uh, we need to uh, now shut it for all the routers I uh, missed before. And uh, our IP version 6 configuration on, under the uh, interfaces here. Let's open uh, the EIGRP. Yes. Let's uh, verify our uh, ERGRP uh, configuration uh, on router 0. As you can see, uh, under show IP version 6 ERGRP, you can see the interfaces, neighbors, topology, and traffic. 
let's start with interfaces as you can see first it has 0 0 and 0 1 here and neighbors here and traffic and let's also see show IP origin 6 route let's uh, verify uh, by pinging uh, the other ends and uh, first let's see the uh, interfaces I got this uh, address, I will ping from here uh, to uh, here, the global IP address. As you can see, uh, it's successful. And we can also ping from here uh, to the first internet 01 of uh, router uh, 2. And let's see its IP address. As you can see, uh, our ping is uh, successful. In this example, uh, we tried to configure EIGRP for IP version 6. Uh, first, we uh, begin uh, with uh, IP version 6 IP configurations, and then uh, we enable uh, EIGRP globally on all the routers, and uh, we also enable uh, on the interfaces uh, this EIGRP. Uh, and after this, we verify our uh, EIGRP for uh, IP version 6 uh, configuration.